Bunny. Right there, sit down. Sit down. You don't get to leave. You got another, we gotta do this. <laughs> what are you doing, Sally? We're back with the star of the new film, spoiler alert, Sally Field. Um, your new film, as I said before, yes. is called Spoiler Alert. Right. Without too many spoilers, tell the people what that's about, if you don't mind. Um, well, it really is just about how hard it is to love someone for the duration. It's, it's hard. It's a, there's a lot of bumps, whether it's a parent to a child or partner to partner. It's, it's, it's hard. It's, it's a love story. And um, that ultimately is what it's about, and family, and um, riding some of those big bumps. And it's based on a true story. Yeah. And did you know this story before you went no, into it? No. Um, Michael Asiello's um, memoir, I did not. Mm -hmm. And I didn't read the memoirs even before or since. Mm -hmm. Because um, I play his, uh, I play Kit's mother, his partner's mother. Um, and they're lovely people. I understand they still are alive, which is great. But we never met them, mm -hmm. Bill Irwin and I, who plays the father. Um, and I just felt I had an allegiance to the text. Mm -hmm. over what really the memoir was, which is quite a bit bigger and longer. So I, I didn't meet them. And I just, I probably am, am inaccurate, but I hope they're not displeased. With your description of the movie? Oh, yeah, anything. <laughs> Me in general. So you haven't read the book. Have you seen the film yet? Yes. Okay, go. so you know what I've happens. I've done that. Yeah, I know what happens. <laughs> not sure whether I was just catching you not know what to talk about. <laughs> uh, do you have a favorite film of your own? Do you, like, do, you, do you actually, like, some people won't watch their own work. Do you? I, you know, I don't think about it a lot. Um, someday I will, maybe, when I'm on the porch drooling in a cup. You don't, you, <laughs> you don't, you don't, wait, you don't think about your own films or you don't watch no. your own films? No, I don't think about my own films mm -hmm. very much. No. Could I recommend some to you? Uh, mm -hmm. Maybe. Okay. I'll send you some links. <laughs> Did you watch The Flying Nun? When it was on at yeah. the time? Oh my it? gosh, yes. I was like, oh my God, here it is. But I can't say it made me any happier. Oh. I can't say I was like, what out were you of doing? My well, you, you'd already done Gidget at that point, right? I had already done Gidget, yes. yes. No, but that, like before you did that, like how old were you when you got that gig? Oh, I was 17. Wow. And what were you, what were you doing before that? Like were you doing theater was, or were you just student? I was student in or? high school. I was oh. a kid in high school. I was in the drama department. I almost didn't graduate because all I did was the drama department. I had to go to night school to get out of high school. Wow. Wow. I, om I almost didn't graduate also. Really? Why? Because yeah, I just didn't do anything. <laughs> I was just, I just, I, I was like... You weren't in the drama department? I did some plays. I did Annie Get Your Gun, and I did My Sister Eileen and stuff really? like that. Well, but not until I was, not till I was a senior. Well, did you sing and dance what? in Annie uh, Get Your Gun? <laughs> yeah, um, um, there's a girl in Tennessee who's sorry she met up with me. Can't go back to Tennessee. I'm a bad, bad man. Do you know, do you know? <laughs> Frank Butler. Break my mother and my girlfriend. My great. girlfriend, Mackie Krawcheck, was Annie. It was great. Wow. Yeah, very romantic. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. And, and when did you start doing stand up? Did I you never did stand up. Stand -up. I never didn't. did stand up. I did improv never. for many improv. years. Yeah, I was okay. an improv. I mean, I studied yeah. theater. I yeah. studied. I did an undergraduate theater program at Northwestern, and then I did improv in Chicago. Wow. This is a fascinating interview it of is. me. Um, <laughs> I'm really loving this. <laughs> I'm really, go ahead and ask me other things about me, Sally Field. I, and, I knew and then I got involved with Second City in Chicago, and then I knew a lot. I respect a lot of stand-ups yeah. tremendously because they put in the hours and the miles out yeah, on the road. Yeah. But I would never call myself a stand-up because they earned that moniker, and I never did. It's such a different world between improv and stand-up. Right, improv is all, uh, you know, yeah. it's all cooperative. It's yeah, all exactly. collaborative. Yeah. yeah, it's all about, you know, yeah. mutual discovery. Yeah, I like yeah. improv in the work. Yeah. I've never done stand up. Well, actually, I did well, a film about stand up with, called, with Tom Hanks. It's called Hanks. stand up. Yeah, it's called, no, it wasn't. It was, what was it called? It was called Punchline. Punchline, sorry. With, with yes. Tom Hanks, yeah. Yes, yeah. Yeah, I was really dreadful. Not in the movie, but just doing stand up. I don't know. Maybe I was dreadful in the movie, too. I haven't watched it. I'll go back. I'll go back. I'll send you a link. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, you know, you got arrested with Jane Fonda. I did. On her uh, Climate Action Fridays yeah. down in D.C. <laughs> Speaking of when you're. Speaking of one of your little Speaking mates of my, right here. One of my friends. I, had, you I, been, had you been arrested before? Not that I can remember. <laughs> Did you have a wild period? Were you wild no, ever? No, I wasn't. I'm waiting for that to happen. Come on. 
You weren't ever wild? I was never wild. Not even I the was, smoking the bandit days? No, I was working, always. Always working, and I had kids. I was never wild. I'm just waiting for it. It's never I, too it's, late. It's never too late. It could be any minute now. Mm -hmm. You could come out of this theater and see me hanging on the light pole. Yep. <laughs> Free Basin Boniva. <laughs> Really, truly, truly, I need that. Trust well, me. don't we all? Don't we all? <laughs> Sally, just lovely to see you. Thank you so Thank much for you. being here. Thank it's you. It's always such a pleasure. Thank, Thank you. you. Spoiler alert is in select theaters this Friday and nationwide, December 9th. Sally Field, everybody. We'll be right back with Nobel Prize winning journalist.